everybody, and thank you for watching the Top Human Rights Organization Review. I'm your host, Bryce Dolan. Now, according to Amnesty International, on the evening of January 29th, a shooting took place in the Islamic Cultural Center in the St. Foy area of Quebec, killing six people and wounding eight more. Now, the government of Quebec and Canada's Prime Minister have called this attack a terrorist act, and a crisis team has been set up in its wake. Now, Beatrice Vagrante, Director General of Amnesty International Canada Francophone, said, Amnesty International strongly condemns this act targeting Muslims, demonstrating a total disregard for life and a religion-based hatred. Hate speech and Islamophobia are unacceptable and nurture violence. Let us show together, especially at the highest political level, that solidarity prevails and that respect for the rights of all people to live in security without discrimination is of the utmost importance to us. Now, ladies and gentlemen, it could be coincidence, but this comes almost immediately, just a few days after President Trump signed the travel ban of the seven Muslim majority nations. Could this executive order help spark this religion-based hatred in Canada? Canada's Prime Minister, Justin Trudeau, did come out and say that refugees were welcome in Canada if they could make it there. So. It only makes you wonder if this attack on the mosque in Canada was related to President Trump's executive order. Only a further investigation could really show if these two events are related. Now, ladies and gentlemen, if you want to look at this Amnesty International article yourself, I will provide a link for you below in the description. Make sure you subscribe to the YouTube channel. That way you can get notified every time a new video is posted. Give our Facebook pages a like and follow us on Twitter. But that does it for your top human rights organization review. I was your host, Bryce Dolan.